Good afternoon and welcome to Aruba Island Walk number 22, leg yeah. number 22. Welcome, Lucy. Thank you, you too. <laughs> <laughs> we are here on the outskirts of San Nicolas. This is the leg that we will head into the town or yeah. the old city of San Nicolas. We are next to the subway and also back here the Wendy's. In case you are in the area, you can check them out if you're fans of those franchise. But some other restaurants also, etc. We will be walking along the main road. It is right now 6 p.m. as we start our walk. And we've tried to put the map um, for the reference for the reference so you know where we are walking more or less if you have uh, gone if you've been to the baby beach there's almost like almost a hundred percent chance that you did drive past this area and our intentions are today or tonight to uh, get to the police station more or less so we got a ways to go and our excuses again for the traffic noise we will be walking mostly along the road and um, that means that we will have some uh, noise, some traffic noise along the route. We are aware also that being further and further away from most of the hotel area, perhaps less folks, are able to join us, you know, and uh, that's okay. We've been very blessed and very honored to have met so many of you already. And uh, we still get a lot of questions about um, uh, the uh, following walks that we still have programmed as we are coming to a close. I just saw a moment ago the police looked at me like, what are you filming? What are they doing? <laughs> Been uh, filming these walk videos for quite a few years now, certainly during the pandemic, I started doing them, making them. And uh, yeah, it's been fun. <laughs> it's been fun to walk so many areas here on Aruba. Hey kiddies. <laughs> as we are slowly wrapping up the series, more and more getting to the end part of it, the last couple of weeks, we do hope. Um, I would love to get your suggestion for future walks in the comments. Let me know where you would like us to film another walk just to throw a few out there, maybe the Palm Beach again, beach walk, maybe a Divi Beach, maybe an Eagle Beach, maybe somewhere else. We'd be glad to start doing those again also and are looking forward to it. Are you stopping traffic? <laughs> we should cross here nonetheless. Oh, no cars. <laughs> Lucky us.
as uh, we will deviate just briefly to show you some other parts. Building here on our right is Federación de Trabajadores de Aruba (FTA). That's uh, the union, the workers' union. Mm, probably one of the, if not the biggest workers' union on the island. Very popular. But they uh, represent so many workers and their rights. And yet, we, even on an island, we do have, um, you know, work stoppage sometimes. Maybe nowadays a little bit less. But we certainly still have them. So now and then, just like any other country. Now, interesting to note, that this road um, has the bike lane on both sides with, uh, with the blue. Mm -hmm. And uh, not a lot of, <laughs> uh, let's say, a lot of roads have that. But this one is wide enough that they could have done it. Strange color. Yeah. <laughs> for me, it's reddish for bikers. Yeah. Here is where you walk. <laughs> yeah, maybe they should have um, kept it as a, a standard with Holland being a Dutch island. But in any case, that is what it is. And here to our right, a fitness for everybody, the cuts and curves gym. Folks just getting out of work and many of them will come to a gym after work, so say from uh, 6 to 8 or so, 6 to 9, others uh, will choose in the morning time. And uh, here on our right is the IPA, so Instituto, I think it's something like Instituto Pedagogico Arubiano, Arubano. So this is where the, if you want to be a teacher, that's where you got to come to, let's say, school for it, let's say. And uh, so uh, from uh, first to sixth grade or so, this is where, <laughs> as Marlin is taking a maybe photo. For Yorin. Yeah, maybe she for Jorin, maybe. Mm -hmm. That's, that would be a good place to start. Um, so I think let's, uh, let's let's cross here. Okay, thank you, very kind. This uh, road is kind of like, if you don't want to go through the San Nicolas city, you would take this road and it will go around it, kind of. But over the last few years, <laughs> it's been built with sp so many speed bumps that, in my very personal opinion, nowadays it's not worth taking it. You take a lot more time because you need to slow down like 10 times on a span of maybe two kilometers. That doesn't make any sense to me, but at least it is what it is and maybe it helps um, save lives because cars were driving quite fast on it, being such a wide road. 
over here at the Dr. Vallejo. And the reason we took a deviation is the Insan uh, clinic. So we'll walk in front of it, more or less. So we got the Dr. Horacio Odiber Hospital that's situated more or less in the um, low-rise hotel area. And you got this one, which is uh, Instituto Medico San Nicolas. Well protected by dogs. Mm -hmm. If something happens, you could, they could bring you here first, let's say, in, in this area. But a lot of operations also happen here. I know my father got operated on here on uh, at least one occasion. I don't recall if it's the second one also. Let's try to go around this part. Centro Medico Rudy Engelbrecht. So it's named after Rudy Engelbrecht. Dr. Rudy. It's, uh, yeah, it's like a clinic. And uh, I was here with him when he got operated on and uh, yeah, very nice uh, looking facility. Might not completely look like it from the outside, <laughs> but it is. And uh, it was built uh, kind of like in a support. We do have uh, over 100,000 inhabitants on the island. Oh, wow. Marlin shows me the uh, the nest here. Beautiful. Oh, they're really nice. Really so are those birds from those nests. We've heard so many stories yeah. which bird it is yeah. and uh, we're not entirely sure. But it's not a troupial. No, it was <laughs> mentioned about troupial, but no. Uh, yeah, so this was built as a support as the, for the hospital and there's so many in inhabitants, it's kind of delicate to only have one facility, if you think about it. Um, and this is the pharmacy, conveniently located right next to it, Benham Pharmacy. I have the same in Holland. Yeah. The Benu Apotheek. Okay. Interesting <laughs> to know. Yeah. Oh, this is the tamarind uh, tree. Yeah, look at how many there are up there. Wow. We can I can show you here as well. This is a tamarind tree. Which one uh, when do you know that they are good to eat? Um, when they're I like think like water. this one is really hard when it's kind of like a little bit soft. Okay. Um, wow, it's filled with tamarind. I love the um, tamarind juice, and, but I do also like to eat it just as a, what is it actually a fruit? I guess I yeah, don't know. I, yeah, yeah. I didn't like it. It tastes new. Uh-huh. <laughs> it's not your thing. That's understandable, but do you do you get it or have you seen it in the Netherlands? No. No, it's not easier or to never maybe a specialty yeah. store or something. Yeah, that could be. Oh, this is also 
very nice place <laughs> with the hands up there and it kind of symbolizes the three for a world without child malnutrition. Hmm. So this is the office of the SVB, social SVB. Sociale Versekeringsbank, social insurance bank, something like that. And we are back on the, more or less on the main road, or at least the road that we were walking. And uh, as we approach, uh oh. <laughs> We hope that you are enjoying this walk. If you are, give it a like, share it with your friends, including on Facebook. A reminder to visit also our website, Instagram, Facebook, Facebook page. And uh, if you are interested in meeting us, we are every Tuesday night at the Santos Market across the Alhambra Casino, where you can find us there from 9 or 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. And uh, we are also selling a few items for souvenirs that you might want to check out and buy yours to take back home to remember your visit to the island. And we really, really appreciate it. and value your time and happy to meet we've met already so many folks yeah. there at the market it's been uh, really really nice this is the Neba cuisine bar and lounge also uh, a very nice place yeah. this is uh, I see the um, I call it a, a, a roof or a tent now this is, uh, is kind of new, probably against either the sun or just rain, but we haven't had almost no rain recently. History makes a beautiful sound. Yeah. It's like an instrument. <laughs> yeah. Every time the wind uh, pushes against it, I'm not sure if we can find one on the ground maybe but uh, you can definitely hear it now again this is leg number 22 basically means that it took us 22 legs to get where we are getting tonight and we have a few more to go and uh, it's been certainly a lot of fun sometimes challenging really warm sometimes but certainly certainly enjoyed every minute of it This is uh, let's just say entering the part of the main part of San Nicolas streets. And uh, I believe here is uh, never eaten here, but it seems like. Uh, a snack or something you can buy jerk chicken jerk wings pork oxtail i mean so nicholas has quietly some really good food maybe not as many restaurants as other places but it's definitely worth a visit and checking them out 
these guys doing an Instagram or something photo shoot of this new mural and we'll be exploring more of them in the uh, oh this is a nice one though this is a very nice one oh we see the um Kunuku bus back there so they come all the way to here to San Nicolas should we go uh, here on this side yeah So this is an old one and uh, it's nice to see welcome to San Nicolas oh really <laughs> lots and lots of music but it's mostly from a car we'll try to walk on this side and sorry for the confusion <laughs> I'm sorry I I'm taking you from one side to the other but otherwise the copyright will start kicking in to our video and we don't want to do that Good vibes, San Nicolas. Very nice looking. Yeah, very nice looking place. The um, it seems like the seats are like a swing. Yeah. 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 Maybe we should try it. Maybe. Who knows? <laughs> now, right next to it, a funeral home. Yep. <laughs> That's just. What is this? Yep, also part of it. Oh, right. Milkweed. Milkweed. It's a beautiful. Yeah, seed package. That later forms into a butterfly, right? Uh, the, oh, the butterflies, the right? Like, yeah. yeah the, but the, I mean the, um, the form of it. Yeah, the seats. Yeah. And here to our right is the Gallo Rojo. Yes. We've eaten there. <laughs> and they have the best cake. Yeah. <laughs> lots and lots of choices. You got fire station back there and police station here. Yeah. Needless to say, the Burger King and up ahead also the Kentucky Fried Chicken. Yeah. <gasps> no. <laughs> <Don't>. <laughs> Marlin is making a joke with me. <laughs> Supposedly she hit that pole. <laughs> so in case you're not familiar with it, these murals were or are painted during the art uh, festival. I believe this year it's, I may be wrong about it, but I think I saw it it's in September. So it's one of those cool events of the year let's see uh, maybe we can go here on the plaza somewhere and uh, do the last part of the walk so we could start here yeah. next time right yes. in front of the church the gas station and more specific oh Kentucky is closed uh, or something no. or they are renovating it seems like in any case, we want to thank you for joining us during this walk. Yeah, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Yes, it was very nice, not too warm compared to the daytime. Yeah, so we'll and I love San Nicolas. Yes. It's really a beautiful city. Definitely. <laughs> Thanks again for watching. Depending for the next leg. Yeah. See you in the next one. Bye-bye, guys. Mm -hmm.